just very recently bought a Raskog cart. And I heard a noise thinking that Simba was getting into something over here. And I looked over and this is what I found. Hey buddy. Simba. Hello. What are you doing? This is now cat bed. Is that a cat bed now? This is my bed now. You don't get to put stuff here. Okay. Hi guys, I am on cup of coffee number three because today I'm not moving very fast. But I thought that I would show you guys around of all of the decorations we've put up recently. Drusif, would you like to join me? Of course. <coughs> wow, that sounded so nice. All right, so. This is our wonderful front room. Venetian blinds. I hate them. First, let's talk about those. <laughs> I got some of those from Ikea. The little seagrass bins, which I believe I had a horrific allergic reaction to when we brought them in. I think it's, it's better now. Are you cold? No, but the stone's very cold on my feet. Oh, I see. So then, uh, so we got those. They're super cute. Now, this is our new coffee table set up. We got, oh, where's my finger? There it is. We got this guy from TJ Maxx. This is a plant you saw in another video. And then Geometry Pigeon has some marigolds in him. That's that. And then we started our gallery wall. And it looks like that. We got the. I'm gonna pin the cat there. He looks so displaced. See, I put the canvas up there. We hung basically everything else on Sunday. Hey, kitty. Where's my kitty? Oh, bloop. So I got those guys. Now, so we've got, this guy's a chalkboard, in case you can't tell. Haven't put anything on him yet. We've got that to remind me that this is coming. Can I help you? Don't worry, I got it. <laughs> what are you doing? I have something against my own tail. I know. I've never seen a cat, like, attack his tail so much as this guy does. Anyway. So I've got this chalkboard. <laughs> Simba in the corner. Like this. What's this? <laughs> I think I must destroy it. Ooh, string. <laughs> and then I've got a little magnetic whiteboard. Both of these things we both found at the uh, TJ Maxx. <laughs> Simba, you're really not helping. So I've got some stuff on there that we have to remember. A new Rascog cart. I feel I felt like I needed it. Now I don't know why I needed it. Got some dead flowers. That's good. Aww. Well, they're dead now. Simba, not helping. <laughs> Why'd you break it? Are you... <laughs> That's why it's been howling all night. What? You didn't close that window all the way. Oh. I, I don't... No, you know why? Because it, the wind pushed it out at me when I closed it. So then we've got this guy. It's the only full-length mirror we have in the house. Hi, Simba. <sighs> you know, if Dad wasn't carrying you around, I feel like it would be much more no uh, normal. So anyway, we've got this, like, big vanity thing. I put another plant on it. I put a candle on it. And then it opens. It actually sits really well on this wall. It's only, like, eight inches deep. And then this opens. We've got all of my makeup and face stuff. And Drew's deodorant. And Drew's deodorant. That's basically the only thing of Drew's in here, I think. Ooh, two things. Listen, just because you don't feel the need to... Just because you don't actually want to look pretty. I don't have any makeup. I'm pretty. Hey, pretty. Hi, pretty boy. No. Hey, my pretty boy. Me alone. Oh, my good pretty Stop it. You're a good kitty, carry it. <laughs> oh, good kitty cat. 
So Drew, do you want to tell everybody why you were so grumpy yesterday? Why don't you tell everybody why you were grumpy? I have to start off with all Yes, because you walked away and turned off lights, which meant you were just plunged into darkness. Uh, well, then don't. So I had jury duty this week, and because I'm an idiot and chose to not change my address when we moved here, because I didn't want to deal with changing my driver's license right before I had to change my driver's license for turning <laughs> 26. I didn't know you had to change your driver's license when you turned 26. You have to go and do the test, and they give you a new license. So I was like, I don't know, I'll just, I'll just wait. Either until then or until we move again. Okay. So I had to go for Lake County, which has the courthouse in Waukegan, which is about an hour and 45 minutes in morning traffic from here. Oh, that's fun. More sometimes. So, you know, it was like, you know, worse than my normal commute to work, which is <laughs> wonderful. Um, worse than driving into city. Yeah. So Monday I got, I called in Friday night and they said not to come in at Monday at 8. And then I called on Monday at 11 and they said not to come in at 1.30. But that I would have to call in again at 4 to see if I'd have to come in on Tuesday. So I called at 5, and sure enough, Tuesday morning, 9 a.m. Great. Mm -hmm. So went in, left at 7 o'clock, got there just in time, checked in, sat there for literally 27 minutes. Because I looked at the clock and I know exactly how long it was. And at 9.27, this lady comes out and goes, so the two court cases that were going to happen today settled, and you're all dismissed. You don't have to come back this week. Which <sighs> is awesome. It's just like a two-hour I mean, drive. It's great. I'm glad I don't have to go back, but... You actually get paid to work this week, which is nice. Fuck me. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. So yeah, it's great. Jerry was grumpy. Good times. Good time. Nice and wow. Looks like our fan cap is coming off of the ceiling. Oh, good.